energy vibration um, for all the sun moon and rising Capricorns I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back this is the second week of October the week begins from the 9th of October until the 15th I want to say to each and everyone out there thank you for supporting my channel thank you for returning every week um, welcome all newcomers and please like and share these videos um, for you Capricorns it's yeah a different sort of a vibration than everyone else which is so wonderful um, this week we have the energy vibration of the lovers and there's absolutely nothing as it's playing out not yet for you guys in the love arena the tower is here so that is good whatever the tower is here it is good because you I have no worries anymore so whatever the situation is and was uh, the tower is here and it broke it down so this is good this week is the week of uh, hair and water it is not a positive week it's going to be a week of a sort of a storm energy and you have the ace of Pentacles so this is going to be a very positive week whatever the situation is happening for you it is going to be an extremely positive week so ladies and gentlemen um, you are the first to receive a Pentacle sign for um, this week so let's see what is going on in this week as we look at this week for you um, you have um, the energy vibration of the princess of Pentacles uh, which is good and we are going to look forward um, what you have uh, this week is a very um, you need to take rest in this week you Capricorns take rest um, you have the Prince of Pentacles with the King of Cups whatever is happening there you have a Prince of Pentacles with the King of Cups you have a rest you need you are taking a rest and you have the energy of the tower so something broke down um whatever that whatever that was there something broke down and uh, there are swords flying about uh, killing all the liars <laughs> sorry it's funny i'm so sorry but it, it's true so whatever worries and whatever negative energies that you are getting or whatever is happening the magician is here and the magician is beside the king of swords so there it seems to be a situation that is happening with you hurt sign people with this king of swords because he's constantly coming back up in the reading so let's see what's going on for you what is going on extra for any the Capricorns let's see what is going on extra for the Capricorns the number four is going to be your energy vibration whatever is going on this is going to be good number four is going to be your energy vibration okay let's look on Monday for you ladies between the ages of 18 and 35 is going to be wonderful whatever is happening here you are taking back your energy you're taking back something that someone has taken away from you you are standing up for yourself and you're taking back something that someone if people have stolen from you you are going to take it back you're going to stand up and take back what they've stolen from you whether your character your energy or whatever they try to do you're stand up and taking it back and this is going to be positive as we move on on Tuesday we have a water energy we have the energy of the king of cups whatever is happening with this king of cups the king this king of cups and this knight of coins so this is wonderful because um, this king of cups you know you um, you Capricorns have a good relationship with the idol Pisces the cancer and the scorpion whoever this man is he's bringing in um, the king of cups to look at a situation and this is going to help him out and you out in a very positive way so this could be uh, that uh, you are with this king of cups so you have a child that is uh, the energy vibration of a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and here is an healing that is coming in and maybe this child need money and he is going to provide the money for this person so 
whoever he's played whatever role he's played it is a positive role what is so wonderful for you Capricorn is said it's a week of rest in the four of swords it's time to rest take rest and connect with yourself some of you are going to be going out partying and connecting with people and having a wonderful time and fun and this is going to be good so it's going to be a wonderful week for you Capricorns in the sense that you have the ace of Pentacles and some people will be resting and some people will be having fun if you're looking for a house if you're looking for living uh, residence it's going to happen for you Capricorn in this week you're going to have the financial help and um, for the people who are looking for to go out and enjoy themselves it's going to be happening as we move forward and we're looking at the energy on Thursday Thursday is not a good day in this week but it's good for you Capricorns because whatever was happening there is the cup of someone and that is a fire sign because he has been coming up in these readings and he has on a, a, a a crown like that and this crown has been blown up whatever that was blocking you it is blown up now and whatever you are work you were working on is going to be positive because you're looking at it growing it's as if you plant your seed and whatever that was blocking it you're looking at it now growing because the tower the universal angels and guides brought down whatever that was blocking you and now an healing is coming in good news again on Friday um, whatever does the tower broke down you can see all of them on the floor and they are trying to um, uh, move themselves out of the debris and you there is a sword that stabs someone that remember I've always told you people whatever you think and wish for others that is exactly what is going to happen to you and see that energy of the tower came the day before the Tuesday the energy of the tower came and the energy of the tower came and break down something and you are going to be justified you are going to be justified against and the snakes are always jealous people liars and that sort of a thing whenever you see a snake come up in cards know that there is jealousy there's hatred there's people who are jealous and hatred and bring jealous and hatred and the tower came and you are going to be justified so this is a good card to understand that whoever were your enemies you're going to be justified over you use use the swords to move them and cut them off and this is going to be good on Saturday this is wonderful you have the energy of the magician and the energy of the magician is coming in justice finally 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 energy of the magician is coming in with justice there's finally a justice and it's as if the universal angels and guides because there's the infinity abundance universe the number eight and the energy of the justice has come in and is going to bring a situation to an end once and for all and this is good so whatever is happening on next week Saturday accept it because it's going to be positive on Sunday you are going to have the king of swords whatever the situation is the king of swords is going to show up this is someone who is an a Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra he comes up and you finally see a clarity to a situation whatever that was happening whatever <laughs> happened the tower brought down a lot of liars and things and all of a sudden the king of swords comes and you're seeing clarity about this person the clarity about this person is coming in so the strangest thing is that this week as I look at this week the first half of the week is going to be wonderful because whosoever this king of cups is he's here to help you and some of you um, ladies and gentlemen 
between the ages of 18 and 35 you're going to be connected it could be your father who is a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion he's here for you he's going to help you second half of the week I love the second half of the week because the tower came the tower is a fire energy and the universe bring in such an energy on Tuesday Thursday that is going to break down a situation once and for all the king of swords is going to come up and you're going to see clarity to whether this Aquarius uh, uh, Gemini of Libran is you're going to see clarity to who he was and what was playing and you're going to be victorious over him and the situation whatever that has been happening so once again um, never worry about things if they don't go the way that you're expecting them because sometimes the universe have a way of making things you know um, it's a protection sometimes the universe is protecting us without without we're knowing that I'm using the energy of the unicorns which is one of my best cards and it says feathers the calling card from the unicorn tells you they are near to you I love this card it said the Carlin card from the unicorn tells you that they're near to you there's also another message and become a peacemaker become a peacemaker whatever is happening become a peacemaker there is an extra message remember that you have the ace of Pentacles no matter what is happening newness for your financial um, ability um, financial help is coming in um, whatever you need this money for it's going to happen the number eight energy you have twice the number eight so it's infinity abundance and um, this card message I love reading the message because I know there's an extra message it says when you choose this cards it is a sign from the uni the unicorns that they have a message for you so look for a sign from them and know they are assisting you I look for a message from the unicorns today okay this is wonderful whatever is happening Archangel Uriel is asking to be a peacemaker be a peacemaker to whatever the situation is okay um, spread peace today no matter what is going on around you just spread peace and I want to say to each and every one please remember to listen to your Sun Moon Horizon sign go back and listen to the monthly readings those are good because there's more information and I want to say thank you for returning have a wonderful week namaste Thank you.